talk about how big your mortgage is right now. Is that the absolute best rate that you can do at this stage? Quickest way to make money. Yeah. If you don't ask, there's no way you're going to receive. It's $1,000, that's amazing. <laughs> so what about the fees? Just a walk over, so easy it is. Everyone can do it. We didn't think the big banks were a walkover either until we set up this incredible experiment. <coughs> Emma Jane Toskin and husband Scott have just welcomed their second baby. Emma Jane's agreed to call her bank requesting a better deal, all the while she's wired up and being secretly coached by financial advisor Adrian Raftery. Oh, hi Joyce, my name's Emma, Emma Jane, Jane begins negotiations on her credit card interest rate the lower rate is, is definitely what I'm after. And she's immediately pleasantly surprised. So automatically we've gone down to the low rate, which is 11.75 from 18.6 in the first 20 seconds. And she doesn't stop there. Am I able to um, maintain the card then um, on that rate with um, a zero uh, dollar uh, annual fee? And we don't have any annual fee now at all. Fantastic. So Emma Jane's dropped her credit card interest rate by 6.85% and ditched her fees, all in the time it took her baby to have a nap. Now it's time to put a little pressure on her mortgage provider. We have just recently had a, our second child, so um, things are a little bit tighter than normal. Ask if, they, if she can reduce the rate a little bit further. Is there any way to, to get a better margin? Emma Jane manages to negotiate a $366 a month interest rate drop scheduled for April three months early. Oh, success. Yes. So it would seem, yeah. even with the bank. $366 is going to mean a lot oh, to your right. family. So Emma Jane, was it worth the ask? Absolutely, it was worth the ask. <laughs> <laughs> so thanks. thanks. Next stop, the McGrady's. They're also keen to reduce their interest rate on a $6,000 credit card debt right now at a crippling 18.24%. Okay, so that, is that the absolute best rate that you can do at this stage? Yeah, I'm fine. That's fine. I don't mind holding. 11.24%. OK. Oh, that's even better. Great. We got a 7% lifetime reduction on the current rate. Fantastic. That means $350 a I'm year less days. in interest. And then there's the mortgage. Mum Tanya spends over an hour on the phone all up but she finds out she's not actually paying the lowest possible monthly repayment. Can we negotiate to change that? That would be great if you could do that for me, please. She's actually getting the reduction in the mortgage repayment. Mm -hmm. So what do you think of that result? Oh, I think it's absolutely fantastic and it, it goes to show that it's definitely worth the persistence and the patience. Ask him if that's the Even the blokes have a go. Alex you. Haddad gets put on hold for almost 45 minutes but it pays off for his $16,000 credit card debt, $1,000 off a year in interest repayments. Counter offer six and a quarter percent. He's moving from 19.24 down to 12.99. He also finds out he's actually ahead on his mortgage repayments, so he can pour more money into that credit card for now. That's a massive saving off your credit card. You've got to be happy with that. It is $1,000. That's amazing. <laughs> That's going towards my holiday. <laughs> Every time we contacted a bank, they were willing to lower the credit card interest rate. They were also willing to negotiate on the lowest minimum monthly payment on a mortgage, which just shows when it comes to the big banks, if you don't ask, you don't get. If you want to challenge your bank for a better deal, remember Adrian's tips. Be polite and don't threaten the bank. Don't ask, you don't get. Do your research. Look on the internet, look at the other deals that are going on at the moment. Be aware what rates are available. It's important to be a good customer. The bank will respond to good customers. The more money, the more power. The more accounts you do have, the better room you have to negotiate on rates with credit cards and also mortgages. If you're persistent and you wait, it's well worth it. Nice work. For more details on that story, visit our 9MSN website. After the break, why 40 is the new 30. There's very little you can't do in your 40s.